Hippie and National Council of Jewish Women, NCJW, were linked before Hippie even became an operational program engaging parents and children. Hippie began in 1968 as a research project at the NCJW Research Institute for Innovation and Education during my presidency of the Milwaukee section of NCJW in the early 1990s, the board and I determined that Milwaukee would be a good place for hippie. We knew that establishing a hippie site required a local partner and startup funding. We tapped COA as the local partner, and what a great partnership that has been. Back in the 1990s, we could not have anticipated that hundreds of families would have already benefited from hippie and COA, NCJW, and HIPPIE are not done yet. My experience with COA and HIPPIE started about eight years ago. Um, before I had kids, I'd been a teacher in Milwaukee Public Schools, and I always noticed that some of the kids came in just so far behind. So flash forward um, to about eight years ago, and a friend had invited me to an NCJW event. I wasn't a member of NCJW. And while I was there, I heard about Hippie and asked what it was, and they explained that it does just what I'd always knew needed to be done, but I still hadn't heard of it up until that point. They were like, oh, it works, you know, we help the parents know how to work with their kids to get them ready for school. And I was so immediately sold. I was like, I'm in. Um, and I joined NCJW, and I've been working with Hippie ever since. I don't have one particular memory um, from Hippie, but I have a bunch, like whenever anyone asks me about Hippie, I think of the family gathering nights and of different crafts we did with them. And I always just loved how excited the kids got about the crafts um, or when they were given a free book to take home. They were, you know, just the looks on their faces and the looks on the parents' faces. They looked so happy to watch their kids be so happy and excited by crafts and science experiments and books. So those are my memories. My hope for Hippie is that it continues to grow. I love the work it's doing, and I know we are now helping tons of kids, but I would love to see us be able to help even more and more. NCJW is instrumental to the success and movement and the work that Hippie does at COA. We wouldn't be here without them. The support that NCJW gives to our program and to our leadership here at COA with Hippie is powerful. Hippie matters because it changes families. Hippie develops parents and helps to nurture children. Parents need tools and Hippie gives them those tools. The first year that Hippie was brought to COA with the support and help from NCGW, I was one of the first hippie parents in 1997 with my daughter Alicia, who is now 27 years old. <laughs> and being a hippie parent was really interesting because even though I was a young mom, I thought I knew what to do. You know, I thought I read to my child, I teach her the ABCs, and you know, we watch Sesame Street. Hippie taught me that there was so much more to parenting and to getting her ready for school and to just bonding that I had no idea about. So it was a really um, transformative experience. <laughs>